Hey, Cassie. Ah! Ah! What a nightmare! It's such a bummer that this will never come true! You're gone! My rock star! Oh well. In my heart, you and your toots will live on forever! If only I could meet you for a sec! Are you talking to yourself again? Get down here! How much longer do I have to wait for you? On my way! Morning, sweetie. We're going on a trip with your dad. What? How? Where? Doesn't matter now. You need to get ready for school. What school? And what about breakfast? Uh, and breakfast? Oh, here's your breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we really gotta go now, or we'll be late. I'm coming, I'm coming. And you, don't be late for school. Oh, Casey, dear. We'll be back in. Are you guys for real? Well, this means Cassie's on her own! Woohoo! Sure thing, Dad, I won't be late. Sure thing, Mom, I'll go to school. <laughs> Right. Not dealing with this today. I'll whip up something from Zach's cookbook. Done. Zach's mom's famous pancakes. Ah, thank goodness I bought this book from some random lady on the street. I forgot the syrup! And the final touch, maple syrup! <gasps> Thanks, Cassie, this is banging! Who are you? What are you doing here? And lay off my breakfast, you monster! Lay off? This is my breakfast, actually! Feed it, weirdo! What's your deal? Ah, how did you even get in here? You invited me, remember? I didn't invite anyone. What nonsense are you spewing? Of course you did. You made my favorite pancakes from my mom's cookbook. And you even called me at the altar this morning. <laughs> what nonsense? This, this is Zach's favorite recipe book. Well, then who am I? You're lying. Zack died years ago. Well, thanks to the spell book, you brought me back. Here I am. By the way, the pancakes are just meh. Wait, are you seriously saying that you... Yeah. Came back and showed up here? Yep, that's exactly what happened. Mm. And pass the syrup, please. Maybe I'm losing it. Yeah, that's it. I'm just losing it. This can't be real. You're lying. Get out of here. How much longer? Leave before it's too late. You are nuts. Where do you think you're going? Ugh. Hold it, I said. Don't move a muscle. Um, yeah, I was... Kind of smoother back then. Wait. Is that. really you? Well, of course it's me. Who else would it be? You really do look alike. Yeah, where I've been hanging out for the past couple of years, cleanliness wasn't exactly a priority. Yeah, I noticed. But don't worry, I can help you out. Come with me. Oh, uh, sure. So you can chuck something at me and beat me up again? I'll pass. Oh, come on. I promise I won't lay a finger on you. Ouch. Yeah, I can tell. Oops, my bad. But seriously, I really do want to help you. Come on. Nope, not happening. Oh, I think I've got an idea. Ooh. I hope it involves whipping up another batch of pancakes. <laughs> hey! 
check this out. Oh, that's even better than pancakes. Oh. Let's uh, go. Come uh, on. Uh, You're doing great. Uh, Just a little more. And... Uh, gotcha. Oh, wow. I must have been stuck there for ages. Yep. But look at you now, a whole new you! I scrubbed everything clean. Uh, good job, I guess. So, where am I crashing tonight? Sleep? Here? You don't want me crawling back into the grave, do you? I can set you up with your own room. Ah, uh, sweet! Just make sure to switch off the lights when you leave. Actually, I'm in a different room. This one. Well, it's not too shabby. <laughs> Nighty night, Zach! I'm not even tired. Uh, tell me about the modern world. I'm dying to know. Let's save it for tomorrow. I need some shut eye. And uh, what's the deal with those things people zoom around on? You. You. Hoverboard, maybe? No way! That's wicked! Hoverboards! <laughs> uh, tell me more about the present! Zach, I'm trying to sleep! Pretty please, pretty please, pretty please, pretty please, pretty please, pretty please! Pretty please. Uh. <laughs> and then I'm like, seriously, and she's all like, uh. Morning. <laughs> Look at her, Millie! Cassie, you're giving on Major Zombie vibes! <laughs> totally! Did you spend the night in a graveyard? <laughs> I'm afraid you'll munch on my brains today! <laughs> if there were any brains to munch on… Oh, how dare you! Yeah, our quiet girl's turning feisty! Where's all the sass coming from? Got a new sidekick, maybe? Maybe I do. What's it to you? He sure won't save you from us. <laughs> yeah, I bet he's some loser. Won't be a bother to us. Huh? We'll show you who's in charge. Let's bail Millie. Let her stew over her behavior. Let's bounce. <laughs> uh, ah, what the uh, heck? Is that a zombie? Ah, it's because of you! We're gonna get agent because of you! Take all my cash! Just don't lay a finger on me! Just got my hair done! Uh, yeah! Uh, take mine too! Uh, and this too! <laughs> what a bunch of clowns! That's our lesson for messing with Cassie. <laughs> oh, jackpot! Ugh, those mean girls, Billy and Millie, are such a pain. Who them? What did they do? They're always picking on me, ever since we were kids! Yeah… We should totally teach them a lesson sometime… Hey, maybe we should give you a makeover! Why bother? I'm digging the vintage vibe! Come on! Let's find you something modern, so you don't look like a zombie! But why? I'm a zombie! Embrace it! Well then, you'll be the coolest zombie around! Let's go! Oops, my bad! No worries! Alright! Come on! Head to the closet and pick something out! <sighs> hey, you're right! This works better! Just need a couple more tweaks! What are you doing? Huh? That's the whole point! Go pick something else! 
Uh, well? Oh, perfect! Just what we need. Now it's your turn. What do you mean? I'm fine. Sure, if dressing like a granny in high school is your thing. But I'd go for something more daring if I were you. Something more daring. I think I have just the thing. Ordered it for Halloween once. So what do you think? Oh, awesome. You're gonna rock it at school tomorrow. <laughs> Everyone's gonna freak out tomorrow. By the way, about school, um, can I tag along? No way, they'll clock you as a zombie right away. Well, you know, maybe today... <laughs> oh, forget it. No school for you, nope. No school for you, nope, ain't happening. Ain't gonna let her boss me around here. Just gonna slip in unnoticed, easy peasy. Hey there. Dig in the vibe, man. You new around here? Don't think I've seen you before. Oh, uh, yeah, I've been uh, homesick for a bit. Noticed you're in the rock. That's rad. <laughs> well, it used to be in another life. <laughs> so, you're saying you kicked the bucket and came back? <laughs> <laughs> uh, something like Dude, that. Dude, you're cool. Want to hang out with us? Maybe jam together? Yeah, we're starting a band and we need a guitarist. And you seem like you can shred. <laughs> Maybe, I'll think about it. Come on, man, say yes. It'll be sick. All right, count me in. Sweet. <laughs> cool. What's up with her? No clue, but she looks awful, yeah. Uh, awful, yeah. Hey, looking good. Thanks, dude. Uh, this is my new look now. Cool. Attention, Attention. We're, we're announcing the My, my Famous, Famous Friend, Friend contest. contest. Each, Each of you must bring at least one celebrity, one celebrity to school next, next week and introduce them to the class. <laughs> I hope someone brings, brings that hottie, hottie for my, my favorite, favorite show. show. Oh, oops, I forgot to turn off the microphone. <laughs> Gotta invite Zach, spruce him up a bit, and Jaws will drop. Just hope he doesn't drop too soon. Uh, you say something? Nah, just your imagination. Oh, okay. So how about you and me? Go out sometime, maybe? Go out? Oh, you mean like a date? Sure. Well, awesome. How about today, after school? Maybe grab a bite? You know? Sounds good. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> yeah, Miss Meg is crushing on some TV hottie. <sighs> Not that. Chris asked that beast out on a date. Why you gotta be so harsh about Miss Megan? She's not a beast, just a bit old fashioned. I meant Cassie. Oh, oh. Cassie and Chris? What does he see in her? Exactly. Let's dip. Can't stand watching this. So, catch you later. <laughs> yeah, see ya. I ordered some food. Thought you might dig it. Really? What gave you that idea? You've been quite sassy lately. I figured these salads and muffins might not cut it. You know, maybe not. I wouldn't say no to a salad right now. All right, let's tuck in. Maybe we should skip this. Ah! What's the big deal? Oh my god! Are you a zombie too? What do you mean too? These are just jelly eyeballs. Oh, jelly! Of course! <laughs> so what's with the two? You hanging out with, uh, zombies? Nah, just messing around! I'm a zombie too! <laughs> you crack me up. <laughs> Where's Cassie hiding now? Yo, dude, what's up with you? Uh, nothing much. Hey, uh, young gentleman. <laughs> You're Riot, so retro. <laughs> uh, yeah, that's me. <laughs> 
What's with the face? Uh, just a little allergic reaction, no biggie. <laughs> so, what about the chilling and jamming? Uh, yeah, I'm down for that, chilling and jamming. When are you free? Uh, once I figure that out, I'll give you a shout. Cool, just hit us up ASAP, we'll be waiting. All right, let me through. Why the rush, man? Move aside or I will eat your brain. What? J j just kidding, lighten up. <laughs> You're a riot man. Fine, go and do your thing, but we'll be here waiting. Got it. Man, I'm totally feeling this new look. I feel like a whole new me. Thanks a ton. Uh, yeah, no worries. Hey, there's this contest at school called Bring a Celebrity. Wanna come? Yeah, sure. I'm down. Well, there's just one thing. What? Oh, ah. Uh-oh. We might need to spruce you up a bit before that. Uh, what do you mean spruce up? This is what I call sprucing up. Dang, kinda digging it. I almost stopped smelling like dirt. And this epilator thing is cool. Finally scraped off all those scabs from my feet. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh. D definitely tossing that epilator. Surprise! Surprise! Mom, Dad, you're back? Yeah, you're not happy? Uh, yeah, totally thrilled. And this? Oh, this is my friend Lily. Meet. Uh, <laughs> nice to meet you, Lily. Is that my robe? Don't be so rude. Relax, girls, we won't disturb you. And hey, I've got some awesome wax strips. Mom! All right, all right, I'll leave. Have a good evening. Thanks, you too! Whew, that was close. When I head off to school tomorrow, stay low-key and don't show yourself. Sure thing, no problem. <sighs> Ooh, be a do ba 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 do ba ba Oh, Mrs. Kitty, you are looking great. Decided to do some cleaning, huh? Nice. <laughs> Why is there dirt all over the house? Oops, my bad. That's on me. I'm on it, I promise. What a mess. Uh, my bad. Uh, I'd offer to help, but I'm worried you'll whack me with the mop. And I don't want to die twice. My back's still sore from the coffin. Uh. Oh, my back is killing me. Uh, right? That's what I'm saying. <laughs> All right. I'll get back later. Still need to check the bathtub. Oh, boy. Good luck, Mrs. Kitty. There's quite a bit to handle in there, too. <laughs> Why is the whole bathtub filled with dirt? Uh, <laughs> all right. I'll go grab that cup of coffee. After all, I feel like a dead corpse without one. <laughs> What's happening? Oh... Oh, <laughs> hey man, looking sharp. Boop. <laughs> um. <laughs> oh, what is this? Meh, meh, meh. Math. Feels like something straight from the devil. Ah, biology, eh? <laughs> and this recipe book. Gotta keep that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What's in here? Oh no! Hey, what's going on? Probably just my mind playing tricks. Hey, sweetie, how's it going? How's school? Oh, it's chill. Teacher was nagging about homework. But honestly, I couldn't care less. I asked her if she did her homework, and that's where she messed up. Uh, 
You seem different. Yeah, so? Just your imagination. Same old, same old. Noticed you switched up your style, too. Well, yeah. Can't rock the nerd look forever. Gotta level up sometime. As long as it vibes with you. Yeah, for sure. Anyways, I'm out. Skipping classes is exhausting. Catch you later. Zach? Yo, Zach, are you here? Got so much to spill. Zach, where you at? <coughs> hey. You're here? Sweetie, everything cool there? Yeah, mom, all good. What are you up to? Oh, just thought I'd snoop around a bit. Hope you didn't bump into mom. She's on edge. Nah, nah, chill. I've been holed up in this room all day. Oh, no! Ugh, Billy tried to pull some mess on me again today. But I clapped back. Nice work. You're a quick learner. Ugh, I'm beat today. Ah, now this is what I'm talking about. What a body. All right, let's hit the sack. Yeah, Cassie, let's. Ooh, 50, 51, 52. Oh, what a day. Gonna grab some grub and meet up with my new crew. Morning, Mom. Looking sharp as always. Oh, I feel like a million bucks today. Thanks, you get me. No words needed. Good thing we are tight. Who keeps putting stuff so close around here? Oh. Careful, it's hot! Ow! Why is this kettle boiling? I told you. Have a great day. Hmm? Must have been hearing things. What a great day! <laughs> hey, you made it! Come on in. We've got your gear ready. Hey, dude, anything you need. Just give us a shout and we've got your back. Whoa, ho, ho! <laughs> For real. We get it, man. You gotta warm up, practice, you know? Wow, this is awesome. All right, all warmed up. Ready to rock now. No way, where'd you learn to play like that? Oh, you know, play it around a bit. Cool, where at? Uh, at this joint around the corner called West Side. That spot closed like 15 years ago. Um. Ugh. Tyler, stop killing the vibe. Let's just play. Dude, are you all right? Uh, yeah, I'm cool. Cool? Your hand's missing. Should we call a doc? Uh, nah, nah, it's cool. I'm all good. But how? Oh, it's just, it's a, it's a prosthetic. My hand, uh, it ain't real. A prosthetic? Yeah, had it since forever. But why? What happened? Dunno. Uh, just how I was born. And my folks got it for me. Man, that is rough, dude. Sorry to hear that. Oh, it's all, it's all good, really. Hey, we've got a gig coming up. Wanna jam with us? You play killer, even with a prosthetic. Hmm, I don't know. Come on, man, you know how the ladies dig rockers. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> All right, it's a plan then. 
plan? Uh, yeah, it's a plan. All right, I'm going to chat. I got someone else to catch up with. Hmm, someone from our school, perhaps? <laughs> what the heck is happening here? <laughs> You're such a riot. <laughs> How could she do this? <laughs> Cassie, you're awesome. Listen, Cassie, I've been wanting to tell you something for a while. I really like you. You... You're also... A really great guy. Just a great guy? Yeah. I can't feel the same way. But why? You used to like me, right? Yeah, but... I've met someone else, and... I think we're perfect together. And he's always there. How could you, Cassie? I'm sorry, Chris. Are you... are you sure? Yeah, Chris. Uh, think about it. I'm sure more than ever. Think about it. I'm the big shot at this school. You should like me. I gotta go, Chris. Let me go. This is so weird. Thank goodness Zach's not like this. <laughs> you crack me up. I hope you enjoy tidying this mess, Cassie. I put my heart and soul into it. And even though my heart stopped beating, I'm still a good guy! And you... What the heck happened here? What's all this mess? What did you do to my stuff? I know all about you and that idiot. Is this about Chris? I'm out of here and not coming back. Don't come looking for me. Zach! No, I can't leave it like this. I gotta find him and sort this out. Where do you think you're going? And what's with all this? Mom, let me through. I need to find someone. You're not going anywhere until you clean up this mess. But it's super important. Let me through. I've told you. Clean up and fast. How could she pick that loser? Ah! Oh, another broken leg that's eight times this week! Ah. Oh, hey dude. Heard about you. You shred on the guitar, right? Yeah, that's me. Man, that's cool. Must be nice girls dig guitars, huh? What's it matter to you? You're not exactly struggling with the ladies. Uh, if only. You know, I poured my heart out to this girl yesterday, but she shot me down. What? Who are you talking about? Oh, you probably don't know her. Cassie? She's awesome. So, let me get this straight. She shot you down while you were just chatting yesterday after school? Well, yeah. How do you know all of this? You've been spying on us or something? <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, I sneak into the school every day and tail Cassie. <laughs> <laughs> you crack me up. We should hang out sometime. <laughs> Big thanks to Billy for hooking us up with Mr. Damon. Hearing about the life of a Hollywood actor was wild. Take a seat. <sighs> <sighs> Over. <laughs> All right, time to hear from Miss Casey and her celeb buddy. Go ahead. Um, my my star buddy, he. Hey uh, yo! Sorry for being late. Hey, who are you? This is actually my star friend. Uh, cool. Um, come in. Uh, Nice to meet you. Spill about yourself. Uh, well, what's good? I've been around the block a few times, both alive and not. <laughs> and in all that time, I've learned one thing. If you find someone who is cool with you, just as you are, flaws and all, like falling limbs or the stench of decay, you do whatever it takes to keep them. <laughs> that was beautiful. Absolutely amazing. Oh, look.
looks like we've got our contest winner. What? My dad coughed up a fortune to bring this dude, and he wins? I am a global superstar! How dare you! Sick speech, dude. Uh, congrats to Miss Casey and her friend for taking the win. <laughs> Thanks for showing up. I had to, right? It's important to you. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! They're really good. Uh, yeah, they're pretty cool. Uh, just give me a second. And I want to dedicate this song to Cassie. <sighs> knew what a zombie love could be but with one glance you gotta hold on me your smile draws me in like a magnet can't resist the love like gravity for a planet Woo! Cassie I love you love you too Zach <laughs> <laughs> dude you're killing it so happy for you, Cassie. I almost believed you brought him back from the dead. <laughs> <laughs> no way. Like, how could I even do that? If only I could meet you for a sec. Hey! 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 Woo! Guys, you watched our video. Look who's back! Hey! It's Billy and Millie! Wow! Missed us? Big time! Yeah. Missed you guys too. Glad to be back. Absolutely. Awesome. So we got to ask you when you saw our video, comment below if you got scared or laughed. Like for example, we were. We were on vacation. <laughs> yeah, vacation was lit. Came back later. Then we came back and yep. they cracked us up big yep. time. How about yep. you? Yep. We were both scared and laughing. Yeah. Both at once. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, today is actually a special day cuz we've picked the winner of our Tim Tin Song Challenge! We watched tons of videos! Big thanks for making those edits! We watched them all and chose the one we thought was the coolest video! Alright, let's check it out yeah, now together! Let's dive in! With all of you! This is kind of special. Looks like something special. Chunky loves team. Team, choose the best to choose. Oh, cool. That's so awesome. Cool. Really this is so cool. it. And what a neat idea. Big thanks to the person who made this video. Their account is called Tim Tin Fans. <laughs> and two cookies. <laughs> <laughs> thanks a bunch. You rock. <laughs> And because you're the winner, you get a spotlight on our shorts channel. Woohoo! That's awesome! And don't forget to hit subscribe there. And hey, don't forget to subscribe to our channel too. Hit the bell, leave some comments, likes, all that jazz. You guys are awesome, seriously. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in. Keep joining us for more challenges. And we now, now get to the, the bloopers! Just asked if I finished my homework. <laughs> <laughs> she didn't catch it. <laughs> she didn't catch it. <laughs> she didn't hear it. Well, she's getting a bit old. Gonna whip up something from Zach's favorite cookbook. Recipes. <laughs> oh. oh, you got me. <laughs> but the truth is, I don't care. I asked her if she had done <laughs> oh by the way i already ordered food for us thought you might like it um <laughs> awesome oh hey there <laughs> you didn't forget what's in there did you i've got it
second chances But I'm Hey there, Monster High! Queen Cleo is back! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Queen my foot! What did you just say about my friend? <laughs> you want me to repeat it? Forget it, Luna. She's not worth it. Hey, look! Deuce and Heath are already here! Why isn't Deuce paying you any attention? Seriously, why are you guys getting on my nerves this early? Move along! <sighs> Don't make me say it twice! <laughs> Laguna, come with me. Whoa! Our mean girls Cleo and Laguna here, and Cleo seems to be heading your way. Heath, cut it out. You know we broke up last summer. Tell her that. <laughs> Hi! Hey, boys! Greetings, beauties. <laughs> Heath, you'll burn my clothes again. Get lost. Sure thing. So, dudes, how you been? Missed me? No. Oh, I see. You don't want to talk in front of the others, Laguna. Got it. I'm leaving. Cleo, this doesn't change anything. I didn't miss you. Oh, come on. I guess you were fine during the summer, but how will you survive without me in school? How will you survive without our playdates? Making fun of newcomers isn't a playdate. I've changed, Cleo, and I'm not interested in you or your playdate anymore. Did he just reject you? I'll remind him of this. He won't find anyone better than me. And you deserve better than some Gorgon. Uh, how about a fiery... Majo? <sighs> Leave me alone. Hooray! Finally my birthday! <laughs> Happy 15th birthday! Yay! Thanks! But I have some news! Uh, later! First, blow out the candles and make a wish? Come on! <laughs> what did you wish for? To be well accepted to Monster High! Uh, whoa. Dad? Huh. Aren't you happy? Huh. Well, you see, um, you're only half monster, the other half is human. If they find out at school... Nobody will find out, Daddy! Please let me go there! People are afraid of me! And this is the only place where I can be myself! Uh, all right! Yay! You're the best! <laughs> I've already packed my things! Wow! This is the portal to school! Bye, Dad! Goodbye! Remember, you can't reveal your human side! Wow! I'm at Monster High! I still can't believe it! Everything here is so cool! Oh, hello! I mean, I'm sorry. Hello, too! I'm Claudine, the new girl! Ah! Claudine! Very nice to meet you! <sighs> Quiet! I'm Miss Bloodwood, the headmistress! Very pleased to meet you! I'm so glad you accepted me into the school! Well, how could we not? You're the daughter of the best student we've ever had! Now, find your room and get to class quickly! You don't want to be late on your first day, do you? Of course not! That's the spirit! She's so nice! Wait, where's my room? Oh no, how am I going to find my room now? I told her if she approaches me one more time, I'll spit fur at her. And what did she do? She ran away. She's allergic to fur, you know. <laughs> <laughs> hey, girls. Yeah. yeah. I'm Claudine, the new girl. And I can't seem to find my room. How's that our problem? Well, maybe you can help me find it? No. Nope. Your room will find you. Hmm. All right. It will find me. How interesting. Oh! Wow! It looks like they were right! Wow! This bed is so cool! Oh! Wait! It's
it's my bed! That's awesome! <laughs> hey there! Are you my new neighbor? Yep! I'm Claudine! Nice to meet you, Claudine. I'm Frankie. And well, let's just say I'm made up of body parts from the smartest and coolest people. Cool! I'm a werewolf! A werewolf? <gasps> so like, wolves and stuff, right? That's rad. What are you up to? <gasps> homework, maybe? They never mentioned homework to me! Oh no! I'll be unprepared for class! Relax, I'm just trying to figure out this whole life thing, you know? I've only been here for 15 days. Wow, that's interesting. I won't bother you then. By the way, what's up with that coffin over there? Best not to mess with it. Why not? Is there someone inside? It's me. That's Draculaura! She's also living in our room. I'm not living in your room, you're living in mine, got it? Okay, no need to get mad. I won't go near your coffin anymore. Phew, how do you spend so much time in here? It's such a tiny space. Do you have a secret passage or something? <sighs> Just get out. Remember that this part of the room is mine and don't step into it. All, All right. right. <sighs> you're annoying. Isn't it time for us to head to class? Yep, it's time. Let's go. What about her? Let's not bother her. She'll come on her own. How oh, so? Laguna, explain. How could he reject someone like me? <laughs> Seems like our deuce can't think straight. It's <gasps> annoying. Hey there. Oh, meow, Lydia and Persephone, finally. You got any news? Yep. yep. We got a new girl. A werewolf. Ew, that's so cringe. Another one with fur? Hey, we have fur too, you know. Exactly. We've got enough of you. <laughs> All right. We need to meet with this new girl so she knows who's in charge here. <laughs> oh, I'm so nervous. Why? It's just a lesson. That's the thing. My first lesson at Monster High. I hope everything goes well. Well, of course. I can't go any other way. Um, hi. Well, hello there, new girl. I'm new too. I'm Frankie. Nice to meet you. Uh-huh. Very nice. And who are you? I'm Claudine. I'm Laguna. And this is Chloe. We're the most popular girls in school. Don't even think about messing with us. I wasn't planning on it. I'm actually very friendly. We can even be friends. Ew. Ew uh, no no way. way. Suit yourselves. Let's go, Claudine. Did we give you permission to leave? Do I need permission? Of course. You're a werewolf, right? I wonder what tricks you can do. <laughs> Probably fetch a ball like a dog. <laughs> 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 well, actually, I can growl. <laughs> Maybe we should leave. Yeah. Wow. You're so good at that. I didn't expect that myself. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is something. I've never seen Cleo scared of anyone before. You're great. Thank you. Hey, you're Claudine, right? I'm Deuce Gorgon. Very nice to meet you. Lesson time. We need to go. Hey, I'm heading to the same class. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? Nothing much. Upset that Deuce is eyeing the new girl, huh? Come on, Laguna. He's not into her at all. Hey, kids. I'm your new teacher, Mr. Colmos. Hi, Hi Mr. Mr. Colmos. Colmos. Let's kick off our first class. Who can tell me who the monster's arch enemies are? Yes, Cleo? Humans. Humans are the monster's biggest enemies. <gasps> That's right. And who can explain why? Yes, Frankie? Humans chase and wipe out monsters throughout their lives. Exactly. But maybe not all humans are bad. Maybe they hunt us because they're scared. Actually, yeah. Maybe humans just don't know us well. <laughs> That's nonsense. Humans have always been the ultimate evil. I heard there was a human who once went to our school. <gasps> Did you really 
are saying about that. Can't be true. Yeah, 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 but he was not entirely human. His name was Hyde, and he was half monster, half human. Wow, just like me. What? You were saying something? Nah, never mind. So what happened to this Hyde? Did he just graduate? Nope. As soon as they found out he was half human, they kicked him out of the school. <sighs> I'll serve him right. All right. Back to our lesson. Mr. Comos, I wanted to ask you about this Hyde. Sure thing, Claudine. What's up? Couldn't he have gone full monster and ditched his human side? Well, rumor has it he set up a lab on school grounds and brewed a potion that could turn someone into a full monster. Whoa! Where's this lab? Where is the lab? Uh, I, I doubt it exists. It's all just rumors. Have a great day, Claudine. Miss Bloodgood, you wanted to see me? Oh, Claudine, come on in. Take a seat. So, how's everything going? First day at school treating you all right? Yeah, things seem to be good. I'm enjoying it here. I've always wanted to go to Monster High. You take after your mom. Shame she's not around anymore. Yeah, she was awesome. I miss her. And what about your dad? You do have a dad, right? Um... Yeah. Well, who is he? A werewolf? Vampire? Gorgon? What's his name? Harry. Harry? That doesn't sound like a monster name. Uh, he's from England. Got it. So, what is he? Also a werewolf? Yep, he is. I feel, I feel like, like I'm, I'm turning, turning into a human right, right now. now. What's the matter? You feeling okay? Yeah, I'm alright. Just really gotta... Use the bathroom! She's quite something! Darn it, darn it, darn it! I hope no one sees me and figures out I'm a human! Amortis Lamare! Ah! Ah! What are you doing? What the heck are you barging in for? Are you casting a spell? No, get out! It's occupied here! Oh, jeez. Calm down, Claudine. Breathe. Breathe. <sighs> what are what you, are you doing? doing? Ah! Phew, it's you. So what are you doing here? Nothing. Yeah, right. Looks like you're up to something. No, I was just in the bathroom. Yeah, yeah right. right. We heard that someone is practicing magic at school. And that's strictly forbidden. Forbidden? Yeah. Yep. Do you think I'm doing magic? No way! I don't even know how to do it! Uh-huh, sure. We'll be keeping an eye on you. Oh, do whatever you want. We need to tell Cleo about this. Agreed. Darn! The books they give us have no information about this hide. I need to go to the library. Hey there. Hey, Deuce. Reading? If you want, I can help you with your homework. Nah. I'm managing fine. Uh, well, you're new at school, and I pretty much know everything here. Thanks. I'd love to, but I really need to go to the library. Well, then let's go together. I can help you pick out some books. I really appreciate that you want to help, but I'd rather go alone. Uh, all right. Maybe we can hang out some other time. Sure. That's a great idea. Uh, okay. See you later. See you! Cleo, 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 Cleo! Why are you shouting? Alright, we saw Claudine. She's the new girl. And so, did she fall face first in a puddle or something? No! no. Then why the heck should I care about her? I only want stories of embarrassment. But it's worse than that. We think... She's, she's practicing, practicing magic. magic. What? Are you sure? Well... Did you see it? No. Well, we think so. You think. Right, now go and search her room. Got it. We'll do it. <sighs> it's kind of creepy here, isn't it? Oh well, who cares? We gotta find info on this Hyde guy. Hmm. Not this. 
not that. Oh, this looks interesting. <gasps> Who's there? I'm ready to fight. Ah! Oh no, not this. No, no, please. I gotta hide. So it turns out you're a human? Not entirely. My mom's a werewolf and my dad's human. Wow. Well, I'm also made from humans, but I'm a monster. You won't spill the beans about me, right? Of course not. We're buddies. Thanks. You have no idea what this means to me. No biggie. Can you control when you turn into a human? Nope. It happens when I'm scared or nervous. But I'll find the lab and this will all be over. Is that the lab hide bill as per the legend? I overheard your chat with Mr. Comos. I need an elixir from that lab. I want to be a full-fledged monster, not just half. Hmm. The school's basement has lots of locked rooms. Maybe one of them is the lab you're looking for. We gotta check it out. Are you in? Absolutely. Ready to roll? Yeah, but let's wait until I turn back into a monster. <laughs> Whoa, what are you furballs doing here? We're actually called Maolodia and Persephona. I don't really care. Get out of my room. <sighs> we were about to leave on our own. <sighs> <sighs> what are they nosing around for? So what's the deal? That vampire Draculaura kicked us out. She almost bit us. Found anything? No. <sighs> Always have to do everything myself. But there's a vampire in there! Well, I'm Cleo, and nobody better mess with me. Did you come here for something else? This is my room. I want to know about your werewolf roomie. I don't have friends. She's just my roomie. <gasps> then you won't mind if we go through her stuff. And what do you want from her? None of your business. Oh, not my business. <laughs> oh, girls, it looks like you've got some new friends. What? <laughs> Who are you talking about? <laughs> about these little guys. <laughs> Sit! <laughs> I feel uneasy here. Relax, it's just school. I think there's someone over there. Locomotus Targavari. Vod Retro Cleopatra. Whoa. She's doing magic. What are you doing here? What are you doing? Magic is a no-no at school. I know. But why are you practicing it? Because I want to. Uh-oh. If the headmistress finds out. She won't. Please don't tell her. She'll tell my dad and he definitely won't forgive me. Why? I actually think there's nothing wrong with practicing magic. We're monsters. Magical beings. Yeah, but magic is something humans do. And my dad hates them. Oh. He won't like Claudine then. Frankie, uh, darn it! Oops, sorry. Uh, what's going on? Well, since I know your secret, I can tell you mine. <sighs> I'm half human. What? Wow, how did they even admit you to this school? They think my dad is also a monster, just like my mom. But we'll soon find Hyde's laboratory and Claudine will become a 100% monster. Yeah, easy for you to say. I doubt we'll find the laboratory. Well, if you promise not to report me to the headmistress, I'll help you. We promise! All right. Where is the search spell? Ah, oh, Asia Hyde's laboratory. Oh, follow it! Look, we found it. What's this? Seems like a lock. 
but looks like only the lab owner can open it. Hey, do you have any spell to open the door? Actually, I do. But it requires snake gorgon powder. Will a gorgon just hand over her snake like that? Definitely not. I think I know where to get a gorgon snake. Hi there. Deuce! Nice to see you. Didn't expect you to invite me for a date. A date? <laughs> no, you suggested going for a walk, so I thought it's not a date. <laughs> Just kidding, relax. You're joking. Phew. So, how's school surrounded by monsters? I heard you used to live near humans. Well, not exactly. We lived in a cabin in the woods, and humans rarely came by. Ah, uh, well, lucky you. Yeah. Oops, I'm so clumsy. It's okay. I'll pick it up. Did you do something to my hat? There was just some lint on it, so I removed it. Um, thanks. Um, maybe you could tell me something about yourself. Me? All right. I'm 15. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm having a great time with you, but I have to go now. Promise to meet up with Hit. Wait! Can we hug goodbye? Of course, let's do it. Hey! Claudine, what are you doing? Nothing! Claudine! Okay! I need a Gorgon snake, and I was trying to sneak it from you. Mm, why didn't you just ask? Would you give it to me? Yes, if you tell me where you need it. It's a long story, and you really need to go now. No problem. I will text Heath that we will meet another time. So, I'm listening. <sighs> you might not like me after this, but okay. Can you imagine well, yes. this? <laughs> <laughs> Did you get the snake? <gasps> yep! Awesome, hand it over. Did Do see you? Nope, he gave it to me himself. <gasps> himself? <gasps> Just like that? Well, I told him who I really am, and he understood. He likes me! Are you out of your mind? What if he tells everyone? He won't! Do says the idea that humans and monsters are enemies is outdated. It's just that humans and monsters don't know much about each other. I think he's right. All right, let's turn the snake into powder quickly and okay. go! It won't work. We're being watched. <gasps> Get lost! <gasps> What do we do now? They'll follow us. And they'll tell Cleo everything. Well, then I'll go alone. You think they won't notice you? Nah. Just stay here. I'll be back soon. All right. This should work. Oops. What is she doing here? Alohomora. Is she casting a spell? I need to tell Cleo right away! Oh, come on! Open up already! Hey! Hey! This is crazy! Come on! How much time has passed? It's been almost an hour. Jackie, Laura should have been back by now. Maybe we should go look for her? What about the twins? There's no one here. What if they grabbed her on the way and they're interrogating her or something? In that case, she definitely needs our help. Do you think we can make this happen? Draculaura! Are you okay? Mm -hmm. Did it work? Did you find the elixir? Yeah, the spell didn't work. The door didn't open. Well, it's okay if it didn't work this time. Maybe it will another time. What's going on here? Uh, Miss Blanket, hi. Well, why are you all so what have you been up to? Nothing. It was just her. Draculaura, you know that practicing magic is strictly forbidden. I know. Will you punish her then? She's the one who messed up. No. I'll have to report this to your dad. He'll figure out the punishment for you. Please. No. Not my dad. I'm sorry, but I have to do it. But my dad will ground me at home. Please don't tell him. <laughs> it's a spell! It's screaming! Did did you save me? 
me? <gasps> of course I did! What was that? Why is the school in chaos? I don't know! Let's search the rooms quickly and I'll try to figure out what's going on here! <laughs> Maybe your dad will understand. <laughs> no, he's been in conflict with the witches his whole life. He won't forgive me. And the school is going crazy too! It's all because of me! I'm half human! And the school is trying to kick me out! And it also framed you with magic! No! It's not your fault! It's Laguna and Cleo! But you helped me! Claudine, it's not your fault at all! We wanted to help you! Exactly! Let's get some rest! Goodbye! You are? I've been searching for you everywhere. I've checked the whole area. Did you think we wouldn't find you? Why did you come here? <laughs> well, we're friends. And friends stick together. Oh, hey, don't be silly. Go back to school. Why? So the school can cause another commotion? Or everyone finds out I'm half human? Huh? Nobody's going to find out. We won't tell anyone. But what if someone accidentally sees me transform? All it takes is a little nervousness, and I turn into a human! See? We'll find a way to get you the elixir. The headmistress has bigger problems now, and she didn't say anything to my dad. So you are staying at the school? Yes, and I'll search for more spells to open the door. Nothing's going to help! I don't belong at Monster High! Ah! It's just like the imprint on the door to the laboratory! Ew. Claudine, you can open it! Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's do this. Mm -hmm. <sighs> She's opened up! Seriously, it's unlocked! Hooray! <laughs> Come on, let's go! Wow. wow! This place is amazing! Yeah, just like the lab where they created me! So many vials here! How are we gonna find the right elixir in this mess? I think it'll have a label on it. Girls! I think I found it! Well, what are you waiting for? Drink it! No, Claudine, don't do it! Mr. Coles? What are you doing here? I've been trailing you and it wasn't for nothing, Claudine. You don't need that elixir. Do you know she's half human? Yes, trust me. Your human side is not a weakness. Thanks to it, you can help end the feud between humans and monsters. Claudine? He's right! <gasps> what have you guys done? <laughs> Became a super monster! <laughs> the elixir gives you the power to get any ability you want. And now I'm going to take all your powers. <laughs> well, why do you need them? Revenge. Hyde is my dad. And I'm going to get back at this school for kicking him out. <gasps> <sighs> <sighs> Uh-huh! Yes! Now I'm gonna annihilate all of you! <laughs> Run! <laughs> Run! You won't be able to hide anyway! <laughs> How are you guys? I'm so weak. Can't move. What should we do? Komos is coming! We can't handle him alone! We need help! I'll text Cleo. She won't what? help! The school's in danger! She'll come! This is this sad! Is bad. So, what's the plan? You run for Heath and I'll go for Deuce! Got it! <laughs> oh, oh, no! no! Not the school again! Ah! Ah! You can't hide from me, monsters! He's coming this way! Looks like it's just us against him! Not just us! <laughs> so? Where's that monster you mentioned? Here I am! Lucky for you, you're all together! I'll take you down one by one! <laughs> Just try! 
<gasps> oh, how scary! <laughs> Now it's your turn! You won't hurt her! Get ready to turn into stone! Oh, how scary! Uh, so ready to turn into stone? Ah! Ah! Snow! Uh, you're human? Who's next? Who wants to lose their powers? <laughs> ah! 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 Save us. Uh, uh, who is next? Maybe it's you, Frankie. Wait! Why did you turn away? Are you too scared to turn into stone like your buddy Deuce? No, but you are. No! <gasps> did we get away? Yeah! <laughs> Claudine saved us. I told you she could do it. Yay! Well, Claudine, you saved Monster High! You won't kick me out for being half human, right? Only a human could stop Mr. Comos! That's why the school was screaming, trying to tell you! So, humans aren't monsters' enemies? Nope! It's time to update the old rules! Can we practice magic now? Absolutely! Especially since your dad gave his approval! Seriously? I told him everything that happened here, and he's even excited about your new interest! Wow! Congratulations! <laughs> All right, now go take a break! No more classes today! <laughs> Jackie, Laura, will you teach me magic? Of course! And me? Come on! <laughs> this is gonna be so cool! Oh, I might as well join in! Congratulations, you're a Monster High hero now! Well, that's a stretch. I'm no hero. You saved everyone. I think you deserve a tasty dinner on me. Well, that's a pleasant surprise. So, do you agree? Yeah. Why isn't she even looking your way? Seriously, why are you annoying me in the morning and so early? <laughs> well, I didn't see that coming. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, first time I've ever seen her act like this. I totally forgot. Hey, hey. Miss Bloodgood wanted you to come in. Oh, Claudia, you've already strutted in and taken your seat. Looking fantastic, <laughs> just like... <laughs> darn, darn, darn. I hope no one spots me and figures out I'm human. Half human, actually. <laughs> I need that powder made from Gorgon snakes. So, what about our Gorga Gorg Gorgon? <laughs> Who's gonna be the next one petrified now? <laughs> <laughs> Only a human could assist Mr. Comos. Now I'm gonna wipe you all out! That's <laughs> 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 uh, totally normal. <laughs> Sis, we're about to play a game. Seriously? Uh, I'm not doing anything. Come on, you're smart. Help me win. Oh. Don't be a buzzkill. Huh. All right. Ready to play? Who are you? Mm. Were you even invited to the table? I'm Donnie. I want to play. You're a bit odd, aren't you? Whatever, I'm the best here. Well, whatever, let's go, come on, let's play. Chris, this guy doesn't even have any cash. Uh, hold up, uh, I've got an idea. We'll play for something real valuable. All right, what are you offering? Uh, my sister, uh, she's the girl who came with me. If you win, she'll be your sidekick. Let's do it. I'm gonna win this for sure. Sweet dream, sweetheart. sweetheart. May you dream of a pink pony. Dad, come on, I'm not five anymore. Skip the pony talk. Okay then, just a regular good night. Hold on, 
Where's Donny? I haven't seen him all evening. Donny's crashing at a friend's place tonight. He'll be back in the morning. Ah. Uh, yeah, he's staying to play that dumb game. Not at a friend's. What an idiot. We're heading out. <laughs> Just don't turn off the lights. I'm feeling kind of spooked for some reason. Seriously, my brother's a total loser. Hey, what's going on? Why did the lights go out? Well, hello there, Donnie's sister. Ah! Who the heck are you? Ah! 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 Quiet, you're mine now. Oh, darling, <gasps> are you getting used to this? Who are you? Still not warming up. Hmm. I'm your boss, and you're my servant. What? I'm a servant? You're a creepy psycho. Hey, girl, you're in Greenland. What will you do? Oh, dear. Uh, my brother will come and rescue me. Got it? Hmm. Is that the brother who lost the bet on you? I won you, just so you know. It can't be true. This is not right. <laughs> You're mine now. Alice, bring the uniform now. Chris, the uniform is ready. Thank you, Alice. Alice, save me from this monster, please. He says he won me during a game. I was there. Your brother really did lose. There's nothing I can do. I don't want to be a servant! Put on the uniform quickly and get to work! What if I refuse to follow your orders? You better obey me. Otherwise, you can forget about being treated well. Ugh. <laughs> All right, what's going on here? Missing? Are you sure? She's not in her room! Maybe she's been kidnapped! Oh no! We need to call the police right away! Da, 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 da. Mom? Dad? What's happening? Eva's missing! We're going to call the police! P police Seriously? Maybe she just went to the store! At midnight? Or maybe she's at a friend's house! Have you thought about that? Donnie! What are you saying? Let's call the police! Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Hey, Mom! It's me, Eva! Daughter, is that you? Where are you calling from? I'm at a friend's place! I decided to stay the night at Ariel's! Why didn't you tell us? We were worried sick! Oops! My bad! I'm such a clueless sister! Unlike Donnie! Oops! Uh, anyway, I'll be back tomorrow! Whew. That was close. Come on in. You can start cleaning from here. Uh, are you a cleaner too? And that girl Alice? No way. We're assistants. We handle important tasks for Mr. Chris. Listen, uh, can you help me escape? Please, I'm begging you. Yeah, sure. Chris might scold me later. Forget about that. <gasps> How could my brother pull this off? Just played me like that? What an idiot! I can't stand him! Huh? <gasps> There's some chest over here. Hmm. Wonder what's inside. Oh. He's as ugly even as a kid. Who let you in here? Are you out of your mind? Touch my stuff again and you'll regret it! I was just trying to clean up. Uh, who brought you here? Speak up quickly! Uh, Casey! Uh, I'll give her a piece of my mind, and I'll make her work even harder! Got it? <laughs> I'm really scared! <laughs> Did I scare you? Uh, I think I went too far. Me. You're so mean. I don't want to be here. 
All right. Sorry about that. Let's just continue cleaning. But don't touch anything, okay? Got it. I'm tossing you a wandering monster with the highest level. <laughs> I've got enough points to beat it. I've won. Oh, no. You lost. Pay up. I don't have the cash right now, but I'll get it. I'll bring it all in an hour. An hour? You've got 15 minutes, buddy. Jeez, it's been ages since you and I had a break. Tell me about it. The kids have grown up, and they entertain themselves now. Uh, let's watch some TV. Let's reminisce about the good old days. Oh, it's my favorite movie. Oh, Dad, I need your help urgently. What's going on, son? Give me some cash, please. I really, really need it. I've already given you some pocket money. That's enough. I'm in deep trouble. I'll explain everything. Just give me the cash. Oh, never mind. I don't need it. I have an idea. What's happening? Why are you messing with the TV? Dad, it seems like the TV's busted. And the wiring, too. We need to fix everything pronto. Ow! We didn't even notice it was broken. Uh, son here was quick on his feet. We wouldn't want a short circuit, would we? Man, it's so dusty in here. Oh, this is terrible. Being a housekeeper is like my worst nightmare. Achoo! Oh, wow. I haven't seen anything like this before. I haven't read in a whole day. I can hardly believe it. Watch where you're going. Seriously, pay attention. I don't want to see you. Stop stepping on our toes. Ah. What's up? Why are you here? Eva, we thought you might be feeling lonely. So we thought we'd cheer you up a bit. Uh, no, I don't need cheering up right now. <gasps> How about we give you a little tickle? Ah, oh, stop! I can't stand being tickled! Ugh. Well, we're definitely not getting anywhere with We need with a this. different approach. What are you two whispering about? Okay, let's hear it. What do you enjoy doing here? What's your hobby? Not so obvious, though. Come on. I'm not telling you anything. Just leave me alone. I told you this was pointless. Shut up. That's exactly what I said. <gasps> Are you crazy? Trying to push me? <gasps> That's enough. Enough. Stop throwing books around. So you do actually like this stuff. Hmm. Books aren't just stuff. You can find a ton of useful things in them. So you're into reading? Cool. We've got your hobby figured out. You guys are silly. How is this even helping you? We'll take all these books and burn them right in front of you. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, please don't do that. Oh, I want to go home. How can Tony betray me like this? <laughs> I wonder if Donnie's brought the TV yet. I think the service center has fixed it by now. Hey, Mom, Dad, how's it going? Son, what's up? You look kind of weird. <laughs> nah, everything's cool. So what's the deal with our TV? Is it fixed? What TV? Ah, the TV. Um, Dad, they told me it's, you know, totally busted, can't be fixed. What do we do then? We don't have a spare TV. Maybe it's time to buy a new one. How about that? But it's kind of expensive right now. Don't sweat it. I've got some rainy day savings just for this. I will grab them now. Oh! Dad, how much cash do you have stashed there? What's up? Oh, nothing. Just wondering, you know, <laughs> what kind of TV we can afford. <sighs> so... How much money have we got? I need to count them. Dad, do we have enough for the TV? We might even have some left for a game console. Awesome. Let me lend a hand. Here you go. It's great to have a helpful son like you. Always there when needed. Mwah. Money. Mwah. Soon you'll all be mine. So, do we have enough ready to go? Dad, why go yourself? I can handle it quick in and out. The TV's pretty heavy. No need for you to carry that load. Uh, all right. When did you start caring so much about me? 
I have raised a fine son. <sighs> Go on, pick out a new TV. Yes, yes, yes! Finally, the cash is mine again, and I can go spend it on games. Woohoo! Wonder if Eva will be mad at me. So, you're really mad at your brother? You're such a traitor. How can he bet on a human like this? I'm shocked too. But since it happened, clean up. Come on. <sighs> Whoa, is this a library? Yep. Amazing. So <laughs> many books. You can't even read them all. Wow. You like it? Absolutely. Oh, you're smiling. First time I've ever seen you smile. No, no smile. I just wanted to give you the task of tidying up this room perfectly. Got it? Uh, be honest. Did you bring me here on purpose? Did you find out I love reading? Nope. It's just a regular room that needs a cleanup. Get to work. <sighs> Wonder if he'll ever let me go. <sighs> hmm. She's into dancing, too. Gotta remember that. I lost! I lost the TV! And I lost money for the new one! My parents are gonna kill me! <sighs> oh! I've got an idea! And a little something extra to make sure they believe it! Oh dear! I can already picture us watching that new big TV! Yep, our boy made a solid choice. I trust him. <laughs> uh, Mom! Dad, I'm sorry! Son, what happened to you? Did you snag the TV? I rushed to the store to buy the TV, but I got jumped by some robbers! Oh, oh! They didn't harm you, did they? No, nah, they just grabbed the cash and I, I chased them down, but then they tore up my shirt and nabbed my jacket! Uh, what about your face? I wanted to catch him so bad, I ended up face planting in the mud. Nothing. I had a hunch. I shouldn't have let you go. I'm really sorry, Mom and Dad. It's all my fault. It's okay, kiddo. Forget about the TV. The main thing is you're safe. Why isn't anyone looking for me? What stories did Donnie tell my folks to make them forget about me? <laughs> Here's your lunch, Eva. What's in there? Porridge and bread. That's it? Seriously? They can't even feed me decently for a whole day? This is ridiculous! This ain't no fancy restaurant. You're Chris's helper and you'll eat what you're given. <sighs> no way! You choked down this stuff yourself! Got it? Oh, really? <laughs> I'll show him. What's the commotion? Mr. Chris, take a look. Eva's refusing to eat and throwing the food. Give us some space. Quick! Hey, what's going on? I'm scared of you! Back off! You're a scary, mean monster! Oh, thanks for the compliment. That's my style. Tell me, why are you keeping me here? I've cleaned up everything. Please, can you let me go? Because you're my servant. And that's not up for debate, clear? You must be lonely. That's why you're so mean, right? None of your business. <laughs> Who's barging at our door? Didn't catch that. What brings you here? Hey there, I couldn't get through to Eva on the phone, so I thought I'd drop by. Bad timing, man. Eva's not home. She's at her friend's. Hey! Where is she, though? Tell me, I called her friends and she's nowhere to be found. You're persistent. Eva dumped you and took off to find a new crush. You know what? I do not buy it. I will find the truth and track Eva down. Ah. 
Hey, mind if I chat with you? Oh, a fool is here. I need your help. You're the fortune teller, right? No, I'm a ballerina. Well, my bad, I guess. Wait up! I'm a fortune teller. Can't you take a joke? Uh, <laughs> so can we get to the point already? Uh, I gotta find Eva. She's my girl. Her brother said she's not home and she ditched me. Hand me the pig. Ugh. Jeez, wow. Couldn't you pick a better looking gal? Um, um, can we start working? Ah. Well, I think I know where she is. I'll jot down the address. It will cost you a hundred bucks. Oh, awesome. Thanks a bunch. Mm-hmm. Here. There you go. Have a great day. Mm -hmm. I think I've reached the right place. But how can I be sure Eva's here? Eva! Is that really you? So I've come to the right spot. <laughs> Hello? Hello, fortune teller Mia? Yeah, what do you want? Thanks to you, I found Eva. I came to the address you gave. Seriously? Wow. I must have hit the bullseye for sure. <laughs> or rather cast a spell. <laughs> Yeah, I've got some real talent. I seriously thought I could only dupe the gullible. <laughs> what else do you want? Going to saddle me with some awful job again? Nah, not at all. I wanted to ask you if you could take care of these flowers. You've already taken care of everything. Perfect. Then look after these as well. Here you go. Wow, these are gorgeous. Are these for me? <laughs> well, yeah. I mean, no. They're just flowers. Don't read into it. All right, fine. I'll put them in a vase. <laughs> Am I actually falling for her? Eva, Eva, where are you? <sighs> and who are you? I'm Eva's boyfriend. I was told she is here. What? She's got a boyfriend? Forget about Eva. She is mine now. Clear? What? Mr. Chris, what do you need? Did you call for us? Deal with this love-struck fool. Oh, I thought Chris wanted to kick Eva out, but he... That was enough chit-chat. Get to work quick. Oh! Hey, girl, what's going on? Just be quiet. Let me go. I got orders to hide you here, and we're following through. You know what? When I break free, you will all regret it! I don't know anything. I'm just doing what Mr. Chris says. Well, I will get my revenge on all of you as soon as I'm out! <sighs> this house is massive. Being in this place will take a lifetime. Looks like you've already made it to the hall. Yeah, I mean, what else is there to do? Well then, get to cleaning. If you act like a slob, this place will never be clean. Why are you being so cheeky? Want more chores? I can arrange that for you. Seriously, I've never met someone as mean as you. <laughs> I'll be even worse if you don't quiet down. Take me home. I don't like it here! And just so you know, I'm not your property! Huh. Seems like you're bored here. Fine! Well then, iron the curtains for me. Those curtains are so high up. How am I supposed to reach them? You'll reach them now. Make sure they are ironed and hang them evenly. Good luck. You're such a numbskull. You've got loads of money and act like you're the king of the world, idiot. What are you muttering over there? Huh? Uh, nothing. Mm. Ah! Oh! Are you alright? I think so. I got really worried for you. I'm not going up there again. I'm sorry for giving you such a task. Maybe I 
went too far. Mr. Chris? Oh. oh! We finished everything. Really? Great job! We've already locked up your uninvited guest in the prison. Let's not discuss that here. Eva, keep cleaning. Let's go. Son! Eva's been at her friend's place for a day now, and she's not picking up her phone. Maybe you should go... Oh! Honey, what's going on? I think I'm losing it! Or where did all our stuff go? Where is everything? Seriously, there's nothing here. Quick, call Tommy! Got it! They must have robbed us when they took my money, and then they tracked down our son and broke into our house! This is terrible! It means they're after us! Ah! Go ahead, spill the beans to your parents, they should know everything! Son, what's happening? Have you called the police? Nah, Mom! Then what's going on? I'll tell you right now. Did you know your son's been playing games? What? He lost a bunch of money. We caught him because he was cheating and trying to extort money. So that's where all the money went? And the old TV? Are you out of your mind? You're going to be in trouble! Have a chat with your son. Make sure he does not do this again. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to, it just got out of hand. I really didn't mean to. <laughs> Listen here, kid. You think you're all grown up? You're gonna return everything. And you'll work for me to replace everything. <laughs> sure, I'll work for you, of course. If they're so smart, I won't tell you where Eva is. <laughs> so? What do you think of my mansion? It's gorgeous, honestly. I can only really dream of something like this. Huh. Inherited it for my folks. Tell me, uh, were you born with this unique look? What look? You know, with such an unusual appearance. Yeah, luck wasn't on my side in the looks department. And your personality, too. <laughs> Ouch. Got a good laugh, huh? That's what you get. Hang tight. I'll help you up. Oh, yeah. Thanks. <laughs> Please, don't move! Quick, cough up the cash, or this girl is coming with me! Let her go! Right now! You can't hear me or what? Give me the cash, or she is toast! Alright. Here. Hand it over! It's not much, but it'll do! I'll catch him! You're done for! Stop! Please, he's not worth it! <gasps> he wanted to hurt you! I'm okay! Let's head inside and warm up! <laughs> Unbelievable! I knew this would be a cash cow for me! Maybe we can play some more games! Eva, should we call an ambulance? No, no need. I just twisted my ankle. No biggie. You know, I'm feeling kind of weird. I let that crook go, but I've never done anything like that before. Seriously? Yeah. Anyone who was a threat to me usually ended up behind bars. Wow, so you're changing for the better. Ha! <laughs> you really think so? Yeah, you're doing great. <laughs> <laughs> Kindness rules the world, you know? And here I thought love ruled the world. Well, maybe love does. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. I can't believe it. I don't even recognize myself. Why am I smiling? Weird. <laughs> oh, you know, Chris doesn't seem as mean as I thought at first. <laughs> Look at her. She's having a good time. She's acting kind of strange. What a goofball. Let's go ask her. <laughs> oh, girls, uh, why did you come here? We've got a little question for you. Uh, go ahead, ask. Why didn't you make a run for it, silly? What do you mean? Where could I have gone? Seriously? You were hanging out with Chris. 
You could have distracted him and slipped away. Uh, why would I have run away? Uh, Chris would have chased after me. That's it. End of story. She's really weird. And why are you always sticking around here? Why don't you leave, huh? We're getting paid real well to help Chris. We're not servants like you. Well, then why don't you leave so I don't have to see you? You've got no business telling me what I should have done. Oops, oops. Look at you. The employees of the year. <laughs> Here's something for you. A present from Chris. What's in there? We don't know. We're not allowed to open it. Oh, what a dress! Oh, amazing! <laughs> what a fool! Nobody's gonna let her go anyway. Let's get out of here. I thought she wanted to go home, but she's having fun. <laughs> oh, there's a note. I'm waiting for you for dinner in this dress. Chris. <gasps> Why did Chris set such a big table? He always eats alone. So, everything is ready? Yep, everything just like you wanted. Great. Please, no interruptions. And here I am. Wow. So that's why he gave her the dress. Chris gave her a fancy outfit for dinner? Unbelievable. The simple girl lucked out. Thanks for the dress. It's stunning. <laughs> Let me help you. Have a seat? Mm-hmm. <laughs> that dress looks amazing on you. I could gaze at you forever. <laughs> I see your smile again. You must be imagining things. Enjoy your meal. We need to free Tyler. Seriously? Why? Something's happening right now. Chris and Eva are having dinner. <gasps> what? Unbelievable. He's actually fallen for her? I knew he wouldn't choose one of us. He's on the lookout for someone else. So you were right. We need to let Tyler go. Oh, ladies, hi there. Are you here for me? Just come out quietly already. I need to save Eva. So uh, how about you tell me a bit about yourself? It doesn't seem like the right time for that. Your looks are quite unique. Uh, where does it come from? Eva, I told you, let's not go there. All right, uh, thanks for dinner. I'll go do the dishes then. After all, I'm supposed to be your servant, right? Hold on! How about we dance instead? Since you're my servant, you should do as I say. Come over here. Stop! Let go of my Eva now! Tyler? Who released you? I'll teach them a lesson! Eva! My girlfriend! No! Donnie lost her in the game! Eva's my servant! Eva, let's go quickly! Eva! How dare he? No! Mom, Dad, what's going on? Seriously, have you been playing again? Dad, where did you get that idea? I haven't been gaming anywhere. The police called us. They said that because of you, I started st stuttering. That we had a terrible talk with you. Yeah, I lost everything again. But I don't know what to do. I just want to win. <laughs> Mr. Nate and Mrs. Christie, I brought your daughter. And what's with the dress? Did your friend lend it to you? By the way, your son bet on Eva and she had to be his servant. Eva, is that true? Uh-huh. Donnie, you're grounded. You cannot leave the house for a month and no phone for a month. You are under house arrest. Sweetie, everything's fine. Tyler, can I talk to you for a second? Darn! I'm in even more trouble! 
Mom, Dad, I'm sorry. How could you bet on Eva? I have no words. Darling, can't you at least say thank you Tyler, to me? you're such an idiot. Is that your way of thanking me? Did someone ask you to? I don't get it. You were held hostage and I saved you. I don't care. We're breaking up. Eva, come on. This isn't funny. I'm not joking. You irritate me. And I don't want to see you anymore. You're free to go. Oh, uh, what the heck do I do now? I didn't even get his number. How do I reach Chris? Ah! Sweetie, can I talk to you? What's up? Uh, your mom and I want to apologize to you. We're sorry we didn't go look for you right away. We thought you were with your friend. I even baked your favorite pie. Mama, please, not now. I really don't have time for pie. Oh, and Donnie wants to say something to you. Sis, please forgive me. I messed up big time. I won't do it again. I'm not mad at you, really. Really? Thanks. <laughs> Right, we'll go with dad, and you can have the pie. Johnny, listen up. You want to make some cash? Well, I'm not sure. I'll give you as much as you want. You can use it for your precious games. I agree to anything. What do you want? Take me to Chris, or at least give me his address. I forgot where he lives. All right. I think I can help you out. The folks at the cafe definitely know where he lives. <gasps> Thanks, little brother. Let's go. Do you think Chris will finally choose one of us? I doubt it. We didn't pass the test. We had no clue about his secret. Chris, don't you see us? Why are you overdressed? You're supposed to be working for goodness sake. Yes! Eva, what are you doing here? You came back? Yeah, I couldn't just sit at home while you're here. Cassie, Alice, get back to work quickly! Chris, there's something I need to tell you. No, there's something I need to tell you. Oh. What are you doing? Chris, I love you. I can't be without you. That's a load of nonsense. I'm the scary and mean Chris. I don't care. I know you're kind and sensitive deep down. Uh, uh. Oh, Chris, wait! Oh, where are you going? Uh, wait. I don't get it. What's up with your face? Why do you look like that? Eva, it was all an act. What? Why, Chris? I was trying to find a girlfriend, but my tough personality scared everyone away. All they cared about was looks and my money. So I came up with this scheme. Jeez, is this some kind of joke? No. You just happened across my path, and I fell for you instantly. I agreed to play along when I saw you and Donnie at the cafe. This is insane, Chris! Are you going to ditch me now? I don't know. I genuinely don't care about your looks. I could feel that you're actually a good person. Eva, I didn't make a mistake with you. Uh, but don't you like your assistants? They're so attractive. Hmm? I tested them, but they failed and ran off. Then I offered them a million to work for me. Ah, uh, so I could have run away and scored a million bucks. Aw. Uh, Eva, don't mess with me. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I don't need money. I want to be with... The mean and scary Grizz. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's dance. Well, since you're my servant, you should follow my scripts. <laughs> Donnie Astral, Astral. <laughs> Donnie's Astral. Ah, where's that goofball going? Ah! I'll catch up with him. Hold on. <laughs> Stay. <laughs> <laughs> Mom and I wanted to apologize. Should we rehearse? Nah, I already did the dispersal. 
Oh, really? I had no clue. <laughs> Sorry for... We shouldn't have gone looking right yeah, away. We shouldn't have rushed to find you. We thought you were with your friend enjoying your favorite pie. Oh, Mom, seriously, a pie can wait. I've got other things on my mind right now. Hey, 